Put the waist in yes. through the from the cow or the human mm. or the goat. Mm -hmm. We don't use the goat because the goat pellets are they are they, they are hard. Okay. And they take time to dissolve. So then you get the gas out of it. Yeah, you could do. You could use the cow. You could use the human or the pig. Or the pig, and then you get the gas, and then you get the bio slurry, which yeah, is the, the gas goes. Then you can get the bio slurry. Bio slurry is here. And it's just like a human, you said. So it eats, yes. and then it digests, and then it, it throws ex out. excretes. Yeah, it excretes. So what it ex excretes is this one. We call it bio uh, When we are constructing, we put it in two. We, we construct it. You can come and stand here and see what I understand what I'm talking about. It's like that. Coming out. And this is clean and safe. Yes. Bio slurry. Yeah. And mm -hmm. it, it does not have any smell. It's nice compost. Mm -hmm. Very nice compost. And it's not only really nice but sweaty. Mm -hmm. So you can now just take it for use. So you take this out of this pond to your gardens. Yeah. You can take it to your gardens. Like you will see where, where the carrots are growing. The bananas and what have you. Here you can, this is the dried one. This is for last season. Okay, so yeah. you have two pits. Yeah, you have two pits. And one fills up and then you use it up and then you'll divert yeah. into this one yeah. next time? Yeah. Next season? Yes. How much gas do you get from this system? Uh, the gas that we get is like, um, calculating it would be difficult, but we count, we count it in, in terms of in terms of uh, hours of cooking mm -hmm. and lighting, we can use four continuous hours of cooking. For how much input? Um, for what we have said, one uh, like 90 pounds. 90 pounds gives you four hours of gas. Oh, you have cooking, continuous mm. cooking. Then you can rest it, uh, like two hours, and then you can continue cooking. It is renewable gas. It is sort of. So you get f how many? Four hours a week? No, every day. Four hours continuous cooking. A day? Yes. And you put in. Continuous. And then you can break because it has. It, it is like. It's, it's filling not, up. Yeah. And then you can break like two hours. After two hours, then you can continue cooking. And, and that's for 90 pounds of waste a week or a day? A day. A day. Yes. 90 pounds a day, four hours a day. Yes. Four continuous, but you can use more. Mm. If you can four wait like two hours, then, then you, you can, get more. You can add more. And then we always add the, the dung every day, once a day. Can you talk a little bit about, the, the, you were talking about some other types of systems. Mm. So there's the dome system and then there's a tube system? Yeah, there's the tube system. There is a, the movable, the movable, movable drum. Where you have one drum on top of the other, we don't just use, metal drums. Yeah, we don't use that. That one you'll see in ginger in the show. In the show. Yeah, I'm supposed to. Be How there. do you think they compare, and what are the challenges and benefits of each model? This one is is good because once you construct it, it it it, it they give us a guarantee of fifty years, and you keep on using using without. The only problem is the initial investment. After that, you don't have any other input. So, uh, and then on top of that, it gives you quite a lot, good enough for the domestic. But the drum is small, and therefore it gives very little gas. Like if it can go on like for one hour and it is done, mm -hmm. so it takes little. So therefore, it, it is not as good. And also this one is, I mean, as secure, it is secure because it is underground, like, like now you can see how planted it is. So it won't get come. damaged? Yeah, it won't get and damaged. The garden is right on top. Mm -hmm. uh, so it, this one is, is best, at least for, for our situation now.